Hey guys, you're watching Boondocking with Dennis. Luciano is in the HEB grocery store here in Rockport, Texas. And I'm being entertained by these gentlemen. I believe they're trying to remove one of those round concrete balls. And they couldn't do it with the backhoe. If that isn't, is, is that a backhoe? I don't know what to call that. It's been entertaining though. I would imagine there's a good amount of rebarb or something that goes down into the concrete if that's supposed to withstand a, a vehicle. And I believe they've had these at every HEB that I've gone through in Texas. Luciano said that that one was cracked. Apparently, uh, something big ran into it, but I don't, I don't see any cracks. Maybe it's on the other side. But this is usually when I answer emails and comments while Luciano's in there shopping. And today, I got these guys entertaining me. I think they thought it was just like a concrete connection and that it would roll right off one guy's got a crowbar and one guy's got a broom and that's my entertainment for this morning Stopped at the mail center. Boat's going by. Boat's going by. And a dolphin. A dolphin. Pretty cool. Went by the mail center. I got one package and two envelopes. So let's do the package here from Amazon. And I got a note in it. Dennis, this stuff really works on the ears. Hope it helps you. Mitch from Mitch. Well, you know what? I don't want to give your last name out, Mitch. Thank you, Mitch. What do we got here? Big wave drops. Comes in a little tube. Oh, a tube, like, like you're a surfer. Clever packaging. Big wave drops for your ears. Soothing and relieving. Thank you, Mitch. That's uh, really kind of you. I'll uh, definitely give that a try. And I really appreciate the gift. Thank you, Mitch. A lot of weekend traffic happening. People coming through in boats. Eugene. Nice people from Oklahoma that stopped and said hi. <laughs> Got some wave runners. I got a joke from Ronald. Where did Noah keep all the bees at on the ark? That's an easy one. The archives. Did you like that one, Eugene? Nothing. And I got a card. I don't want to show it to you, but there's a puppy dog on their uh, return mail address. And I got a card. Crow. Maybe it's a grackle. Could be a Larry. Sunflowers. And it says, thank you, Tom and Kay. And uh, there's another note in here. Oh, something's inside. Oh, wow. Very nice gift inside of the note. And I, it, uh, they sent me a very nice check. I don't want to show that on uh, camera. Camera? Camera. Dennis, this past year, my wife Kay and I have been riding along with you in Rockport. We feel we've learned a bit about you and thought we'd introduce ourselves to you. For the past 22 years, we lived in the Ozark Mountains in Northwest Arkansas. That is beautiful. We moved here from Fort Worth. Prior to that, we lived in Minneapolis. 
Chicago, my hometown, and Indianapolis, Kay's home. We've been married for 45 years. You guys have traveled. You've gotten to some nice spots. We have been visiting Rockport since 2010. That first visit, sight unseen, we stayed there three months in our motor home. Wow. After that, we've returned twice a year, staying in various Airbnbs with our current dog, Cooper. That's an awesome name, Cooper. Hey, Cooper. Hey, Cooper. We love the area, the weather, beaches, port A, restaurants, birds, H-E-B, and lifestyle. We consider it our home away from home. When we aren't there, we like hopping in with you in your F-150 and riding along. You've given us some great new places to check out in our next visit in the fall. We appreciate you. Thank you, Dennis. God bless you. Tom and Kay and, and Cooper. Tom and Kay and Cooper. Thank you very much. That's a very nice note and the card is great and uh, I appreciate the gift. I, I hope I get to meet you and say hi on uh, one of your visits. Thank you very much. I just had a Rosette Spoonville fly by and I saw one flying by yesterday. It's on this side of the water, right in the tall grass there. Kind of to the left. Waiting for him to pop up. There he goes. She goes. And they nest out on that little island out there in Little Bay. I don't know if you can make them out, but where the pinks and whites are, that's the rosette spoonbills. And they get that pink color from eating shrimp. It's a pigment that stays in their feathers. The last card, guys, is from my buddy Gary. And uh, Gary's in Louisiana. The Shreveport General Area. Look at this card. Look at that card. Dogs and butterflies. You can't go wrong. Happy birthday to me. That's right, Gary. You just had a birthday on the 3rd, was it? June 3rd? Happy birthday, Gary. Hello, friend. Hi, Dennis and friends. We should elect you as ambassador for the homeless. I admire you for what you do. Stay safe, my friend. God bless your friend, Gary. Louisiana sent on 6-3. Thank you very much, Gary. That's very kind of you. And Gary put some uh, gift cards in here. Uh, one for McDonald's and one for Subway. And there's a note on the back that says to share these with uh, some other people. So I'll pick up food for everyone with that Subway gift card. Gary, thank you very much. These are uh, extremely generous of you, buddy. And I hope to see you again on your next visit. Well, we didn't get much of a sunset. But about 20 minutes after the sunset, it got really pretty. That happens quite a bit. It's kind of the same way with a sunrise. Half hour, 20 minutes before the sun rises, that's when we get the pretty colors here. Hit a little bump. Sorry about that. <laughs> it's a pretty time at night. There's still a lot of people here at the beach. Good evening, Kevin. Sleep well tonight, buddy. Lots of families came out today. And that was a good thing. It's always nice to see people having a good time. Thanks for all your thoughts and prayers, guys. Thank you for the wonderful gifts I received. Thanks for riding along today. Thanks for watching.